What's up guys, it's Neil here with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to get the one-handed mode feature on any Android device. So as devices get larger and larger, it gets a little more difficult to use it with one hand. Granted, most devices that are on the larger side do come with a one-handed mode feature, some don't like the Nexus 6 and even if you do have the one-handed feature it may not be exactly to your liking because everyone's hand is not the same size. So in order to get this feature on your device all you need to do is have a rooted Android device you also need Expose Framework. After doing that you just go into Expose oh, let's go this way enter Expose and we're going to use the search option. We're going to go to download search and you're gonna put one hand it should come up right away there you go one hand mode for all devices you're just gonna go ahead and install this after doing so make sure to properly activate it if you're not sure how to do that check out the full guide on gadgetx.com so with it installed and enabled we're gonna go into the actual interface or user interface one hand mode right here now from here you can adjust the margins Let's actually dim this since it's so white. You can actually adjust the margins or you'll see what I'm talking about for the apps for the notification center. And we're going to go ahead and just do the apps right now. So I'm going to go ahead and turn this on. Now as it describes right here, one hand mode works by putting margins around the screen. So you'll see once I do so. I'm going to suggest starting low when you do this because if you go to a pretty high value it will actually make it difficult to use the device thus resulting in you not being able to revert back to normal so depending on your device's size I'm just gonna say let's go with 50 to begin with and you'll notice it may not make that big of a difference but once you uh, see how much it's changed you can increase it so let's just do 100 right now and apply it and there you go you see the screen shifted just a tiny bit not too much uh, the home screen was adjusted as well. Take a look right here. I adjusted it so I have a margin up at the top and the left. I increased those margin sizes, but now that I have a feel for it, I'm going to actually increase the value to where I had it initially. So let's go to 180 because I felt that that looked best on this device. So my home screen is adjusted. I can easily use it with one hand. There you go. Take a look. So it's pretty useful. Also, as mentioned, you can apply this to the notification center. So let's go ahead and just show you what that looks like. I'm going to go ahead and toggle it on. I've already adjusted the margins. And now take a look. I can easily use this with one hand and do all the things I normally do. The module also comes with other settings. As you can see, if you want to show a notification for easily toggling the service on or off, you can make the notification transparent. There's also a show toast when toggling on. There's also show solid background around apps once shrunk. So if I do enable this, I can actually just pick a color and it'll show up around the blank area. And then you can also dictate what the toggle does in your notification center. Now I'll suggest using the widget that comes with this because you can easily turn the service on or off just by tapping the widget which is pretty convenient but as I mentioned if you do already have a one-handed mode and you're not that content with it this will let you tweak it any way you like it and take full advantage of it so definitely check out the full guide on gadgetx.com also don't forget to like comment and subscribe for some more awesome gadget hack videos thanks guys